than I have had before. Man, it's been really, it's just been powerful, man, just to hear people talk about their faith in Christ and how the, the, the couple that just talked today was really good. Um, we went home, Ruth and Paul, and just about their faith and how they've matured in their faith to the point where they just are just so to totally sold out to Jesus that, you know, everything that they are is Jesus, it seems like. Faith Haven is a wonderful experience, a good time of fellowship, seeing good friends and fellowshipping uh, fellowshipping in the Lord and uh, just really getting into His Word and finding out uh, what it's like just to be with a big, a big group like this. Uh, it's kind of a mountaintop experience, that's why I always describe it. I think we should have an alumni Faith Haven. Outreach has given me a great opportunity to have a Christian fellowship with people that uh, have, uh, have come from many different backgrounds. When you have these many different kinds of people, you see many different insights that you would not find from uh, just your own experience. I think the most important thing that I hope that the students learned this year through Outreach is just that each person has grown closer in his relationship with Jesus Christ. And I think that's the primary focus of Outreach, just to as well as going out and sharing your faith, but just each person growing at their own rate and that they're, they can learn through their Bible studies and going out just um, how important that is to them. Outreach to me has meant a lot, especially as far as my spiritual life and my spiritual growth. I've learned how to openly share my faith, how to lead and just participate in small group Bible studies, I've met lots of very wonderful Christian friends and had just fantastic opportunities for Christian fellowship. In my four-year involvement with Outreach, one of the most special times was my summer team experience last summer. For 10 weeks, we toured through North Dakota, Montana, and Minnesota. And 
of our eight weeks in Montana, the time we spent in Glacier was a very special time for me. One evening I took my Walkman and walked up to the top of a mountain and listened to the song Montana Sky by Whiteheart and during that time I felt that Lord, the Lord was really with me at that time. He spoke to me and really let me know that He was going to be with me throughout the next few years and, that, and during that time I totally rededicated my life to God.